Hi everyone, uh, this is Ben from Eretabe Gardens in Atlanta, Georgia, Zone 8, Happy New Year. This is the 13th of January, 2019. I want to show you something that is going on in my guest bedroom that I use as my greenhouse. I only use it during winter time. Um, when the winter started, I have some fig trees in the pots that drop leaves and then I bought some new fig trees as beer roots early part of December 2018 last month and I brought them in and to my surprise they are all bringing out leaves they ought to be dormant but I'm seeing something different let me show you so you can see this is my guest bedroom I've turned it into into greenhouse but let me show you some of my fig trees now this one right here is olympian i bought it in december last month as beer root and to my greatest surprise look at what it's doing it is growing like crazy now this is supposed to be dormant, so this is an experiment for me. I don't know what will happen when it comes to spring and summer, but it is growing like crazy. Here is my Israeli Holy Land fig tree. I bought it uh, towards the end of um, summer. Then it dropped leaves and then I brought it in and now it's doing fantastic. Um, here is my little Miss Fig here. I bought it towards the end of summer and it's doing well too. Now here is my Letizia. It's still a little bit dormant, you can see though it has one leaf here but it's not growing it's a little bit dormant it's just bringing out leaf you can see it right here next to it is my pineapple that is doing beautiful and then next to it this is my um texas ever berry you can see it's doing good. Look at it right here. It adds about four branches. Here is another one. And here is another one. You can see it has four branches. One, two, three, four. And here is my white genoa. I brought it in when the winter started with no leaves and now look at what is happening here. Next to it is my Black Petite Negra. I've never seen Black Petite Negra having these mighty leaves. Look at it. Bigger than my hand. This is different from what I've seen on YouTube. But this is a new experience for me. And next to it here, this is my Texas Blue Giant. It is doing real good. Look at the leaves. Look at the leaves. Look at it. Oh, man. I'm looking forward to have some fig fruits in summer. Now, let me show you my... My next one here is my Chicago Hadi. I bought it as beer root. Um, I think early December, and it came with just one fruit on it, but as beer root. And then I plucked out the fruit, and before you know it, it started growing like crazy. This is surprising that my Chicago Hadi is growing real good. Um, this empty box here is where I put my successful uh, 
curtains. I took them to the guest bathroom to water them. I'm going to do a video later on about them. And then this one here is my black jack. I got it from Willis Orchard in Georgia. Carrasville, Georgia. I bought it as beer root. I got it last month, December, and look at what it's doing. Now I got I bought this ever beer in here, but it didn't produce leaves. I cut it to see if it's going to. But I call I sent an email to the guy that I bought it from on eBay and he sent me another one. But right now the other one I left it in a water container to bring to wake it up before I will plant it back in this same container. Now this one here is my giant brown fig. It's also called Goliath. I bought it as beer root and it's doing well. Here is my panache. Here is my panache, you can see it. I bought it last month as beer root. But look at this. <laughs> ah, it's supposed to be dormant, but I'm not afraid because I know people in California, people in Florida, they don't have cold weather like Georgia. So they still have fig trees with leaves all through the winter season. So I'm not scared. I know something good. So I'm looking forward to taste my panache. And then the one next to it is my Celeste. I bought it in summer last year and then I left it outside um, and winter time it lost all the leaves and then I was scared I don't want to leave it outside and then it died so I brought it in and look at what is happening it is doing well so this is an experience for me and a new experiment uh, on this side here are my fig trees that I bought from Wellsprings they were very very little very very little just like this this one is not doing too well this was the size just like this one too but look at others from Wellspring that is my it's sheer green or it's kaya green that is my letizia this is my white texas ever bearing i don't know what is happening to it that is my uh, yellow long neck i got it from uh, world springs um this is another panache but I got this from somebody else and he's doing well. Um, this is my little ruby from Well Springs. It's catching up. This is my LSU purple. I bought it from Well Springs. It's doing well. Uh, this is my Valet Valet de Bordeaux. And it's doing well too. I bought it from Wellsprings. And it's doing well. Yeah, it's my Chicago ID from Wellsprings. It's not doing too well. And then this is my Texas Everbearing that I bought from Wellsprings. Uh, summertime. Now they are all catching up gradually. This is my desert king from well springs you know um this is my this is my cadoda from well springs you know and this is uh, my black mission from well springs you know so i'm happy with what is happening in my green house 
thank you for watching. If this has inspired you, please like the video. And if you want to subscribe, please do. Uh, once again, Happy New Year. I'll be posting a lot of videos this year about fig, especially. It's like now I'm crazy about fig trees. And once again, Happy New Year. Have a wonderful and successful fig season. Bye.